to my channel and welcome if you are new my name's Anitra hey y'all oh she's speeding through the parking Where is everybody going that fast <laughs> if you're new here please consider subscribing to my channel okay y'all I went to that gym I was trying to record but I went early and people was in there People were in there. It's Saturday and it's early. Well, it's nine o'clock now. And let me tell you something. People was in there. I mean, <sighs> do what you must, but my goodness. Hello, good morning. <coughs> I'm trying to get on people. Oh my God. Now, friend, what you been over there doing? Cause you, you, you don't say much. I am now on my way. After. I don't know when neither one of my good sunglasses, my pairs of sunglasses are. Well, I have a pair right here. I just need to be having sunglasses everywhere in the car, but the ones I like to wear, I don't know where the heck they are. I think they in the house. I got these pair. They dirty, but I need to shield my eyes. Anyway, we are on our way to run a couple of errands. Um, I need to go to Target. Ooh, that, look at these sunglasses. They crooked. Lord, oh shoot, that's Ben. Let me go ahead and bend them back. See, this is why I don't buy expensive sunglasses. That's gonna have to do. Ooh, they still crooked though. Oh, hold on. Let's bend them. Let's bend them a little more. That's why I don't buy expensive sunglasses. Cause I don't. I ain't. I just be throwing them anywhere. Oh, that's gonna have to do. Anyway, I don't like that crookedness, y'all. I don't like it. Um. I gotta run to Target real quick to get a couple of things. I'm going to my friend's birthday party today. She's turning 40. Welcome to the club, girl. Welcome to the club. Um, so I'm gonna go and pick up a couple of gifts. This morning you saw what I had. I had a protein shake. I had a little um, MCT oil too in it so I can get some of that in early on because what I'm finding is later on in the day I'm like, I ain't my fat. I ain't met my fat. So I'm adding it on early so then I can try to like not have to, so I don't have to try to figure out later in the day. Anyway, so we're gonna run a Target and then we're going to, if I see an Instacart order that I like, I'm gonna go do that. Well, I don't do Instacart very often, but when I do see the do it, I do the ones that are like good orders. Some of these people on here don't even have a tip. And I don't understand uh, if, uh, if if they add the tip on later. I don't know if I told you guys this. I don't know if they add the tip on later. But I'm never taking an order that has no tip. Especially, if, and, and, and I'm not doing an order that has a $2 tip. I'm sorry, I'm not. So I don't know if y'all do Instacart. And if you do, not like deliver or pick up. But if you order groceries on Instacart, I personally don't. I just want to go through myself stuff myself but if you tip how much are you tipping because the thing about this is how i think with the instacart like this is not a pizza delivery where you know they're just delivering the pizza we are going in the grocery stores actually shopping for you two dollars who's or no tip get out of here get out of here i'm sorry get out of here so yeah how are you guys doing? If you are in the wellness, 30 day wellness challenge, how are you doing? Whether you're doing keto, low carb, weight watchers, um, tracking calories, um, are you doing that and how well are you doing? Secondly, in regards to the wellness portion, what are you doing for your wellness? Are you journaling? Are you doing yoga, breathing, um, exercises? You know, all the good things that, that that's in the category of wellness and self-care i'm doing all of the above all of the above okay i'm actually looking into starting to take a yoga class um because you know they're on youtube but i like to I've, I've taken a yoga class one time and i got so sick from it so i never did it again and they told me it's because of the toxins in my body and i'm like dang i got that many toxins i got so sick like headache sick where it was like nausea um, so I never did it again but that was some years ago so I was thinking about doing it again because I want to really not only focus on stretching my body out but I do want to get the um, I guess 
like the peacefulness part of it. I don't know if that's the right words to choose, but I want to do that. And then there's a salt cave place that's close to here, and I want to do salt. Um, it's like a salt cave, and it's literally for your your mind and your your wellness and all that. And I want to go do that. I don't know when, but I want to do it soon. I have a friend that goes, and she loves it. So I'm like, I'm gonna get to that dang salt cave. So I want to do that. Um, but those are the only things that I can think of. Also, I want to start doing hikes. But I need to first um, find a. There's plenty of places to do hikes around here. But if I do them, because it's getting hot, I'm gonna have to go very, very early in the morning. I can't depend on other people to come with me. I'm just gonna have to get up and go. Um, so I'm gonna have to find a place that's one, safe, okay? And two, that's like kind of user friendly because I don't, I'm not a hiker. I just wanna be able to uh, do a kind of a difficult walk where it give me some type of um, sweating and exercise and whatnot. And, um, and then I'm like, I want to get some um, some hiking shoes because um, I don't really have like shoes that I would want to hike in. That is something that I want to start getting into doing like morning hikes and things like that. And like I said, I have to find somewhere that's really safe because last year was it the year before. There's this lady that was hiking. Now we, I still don't know the full story on that. She was hiking in a popular, popular hiking place, okay? Her and her friend went there in the morning to hike. And I don't remember if she said that she had to leave early or she... No, she didn't. When they left, her friend went to her car this way. She went back some other way. And that lady came up missing. And then she was found dead in a dumpster. So, I don't know the whole story behind that I don't know if I don't know like that's scary to me so yeah and they said that she hiked all the time or she did that little that um hike all the time like several days a week are you gonna come okay thank you I, I, I thank you for looking both ways but please just go okay I'm gonna go because y'all y'all doing too much I, I got time okay anyway so that is what I want to do. That is what Anitra wants to do. I want to start venturing out on other types of activity other than just going to the gym. I like the gym. I don't have a problem with going to the gym. Um, but I want to start um, looking at other options of um, exercise. That's what I'm trying to say. Y'all know. If you're new here, I, sometimes I lose my train of thought. I get distracted like this. Mine be going over here. I'll be talking and I'll be like, oh, it is 9.20 in the morning and the parking lot is packed. This part, this Target right here is the most crowded Target in my life. The, the, the other Targets are not crowded like this, but this one's crowded. This Target's very crowded all the time, all the time. So, like I was saying, what are you guys doing for your wellness reset? And how are you doing on your wellness reset? I'm doing well. I'm doing well. I'm going to do a full recap um, after I do my weigh-in on Tuesday. But, yeah. I was trying to think how I want to do these videos. Do I want to do... Uh, what I eat in a day weekly and then give you the recap then a weekly recap and then with the with, with I want to with uh, what I eat in a day or do I want to rec record clips throughout the week rec and make it into like one video and do the recap like that I want to go get a manicure real quick but I know I'm not gonna be able to do that because for one I'm not gonna be able to find a uh, a black nail tech that takes walk-ins you know a lot of people take um don't take walk-ins well a lot of black nail techs don't take walk-ins they have that book you have to book and send a deposit and whatnot the thing about the asian salons you can walk in get your manicure your pedicure and be done but anitra mm -mm. 
no so I guess I won't be getting a manicure today but it would be nice if I found a black nail salon that just took walk-in so I can just go in and walk in and get my manicure and pedicure and walk out that sucks man <sighs> somebody create one these glasses are still crooked okay let me go I'm about to go in this Target if I can record for you I will I like my hair like this, y'all. It's giving me very much a little mo, very much a 2000s. I want, next time I'm gonna get them way longer, probably to my butt, but um, I still love them. I don't, I, even when little mo was like popping and she used to wear her hair like this, I didn't wear my hair like this, but this is, this is not an Anitra thing, but it, it may be. You know, <laughs> let me go in this Target. I'm trying to think, do I want me a coffee or do I want to make my coffee? I could make my coffee. I think I'm gonna make my coffee and save some money, child. Cause listen, the way I've been spending money is a no go for me. We'll talk about that at a later time. Just extend the hand of prayer, okay? Just, just extend the hand of prayer. See, this is the kind of stuff that I need help with. Very cute. It's a romper, it has shorts. It's $30. <sighs> I'm not gonna get it. But I love it. I love it, I love it, I love it. See, I need to stay out, I'm not going in there. For a brow pomade, for my brows, of course. Um, I have a brow. This is what I have right now, this feeling fluff. But I want to get a pomade. I haven't used a pomade in so long, but I want one. Is that? I want this. I don't know if I should get this color or should I get this one's called Puppy Love. And then we got Teacher's Pet. And then we got, ooh, that's another Teacher's Pet. Um, Frank Kong. I love a good red. But that's, I don't know. I see you dress. to get them a bath and body gift card so I don't have to go inside a bath and body. But let's okay, see. I'm out of the Target. Now, um, I forgot to get a card. Oh, God dang it. Oh, but I can, go to, I can go to Dollar Tree. I forgot to get a card and I forgot to get a bag. Um, and I walked right past the area. Speed walking too. So I'm gonna go get that. All right, I like that little, I like that Mar Mar Marymount bag. Um, what was I gonna say? So I need to go into Bath Body Works to get her a gift card. And then I'll go to Dollar Tree, boom. And then I'm done. But I do need to go over here to this cookie plug because they have keto cookies. So um, they are both doing keto as well. I don't know if they're really doing it. Um, but I know that they've been, one of my friends been like, I want an apple. An apple, girl, you can't eat that. You can't have no apple. So I'm going, I know it's going to be cake here. I'm not eating no damn cake. I'm not eating no damn cake. And it's a sipping pain. I'm not sipping on nothing. <sighs> I'm going to have to find something. Probably won't even drink today. I just probably won't. Because last week did me in. And it's almost close to my way in. And I just, um, I'm going to buy three keto cookies because there's a place here called cookie plug and they sell all types of cookies regular cookies the cookies are huge gluten-free vegan keto um and they have them everywhere now like I, I, in southern california um and the place is so cute if i can record when i get in there they it's not cute because it's 
cute off of this but the idea is catchy because the people love it they um it's called a cookie plug and they put the cookies in a plastic bag that has a uh, what's the thing called like not a ziploc bag, but you know ziploc bags that have that thing They have them in that I think they still have them in all that But if you've been to a dispensary, <laughs> that's how they give you your product and then um, They have this the drinks that they have is called the drink and they sell it in a um, a Double styrofoam cup no top just a double styrofoam cup. They're really playing off of the stuff child and just the, the names of these cookies and stuff is just like y'all really playing off of this weed culture honey anyway but i'm gonna first go to bath and body works do i have any shoes in here my feet are hot i don't like wearing socks and stuff after the gym like the gym that's good enough after that i don't really bother I put these i had these in my car so i'm gonna put these on um so my toes can be free I don't, I don't like wearing socks for too long. I be feeling like my feet are constricted. My friends are doing the wellness challenge with me. These two have chose to do keto with me. And I don't, they not really, they not really on top of it. They not, they not. You can do all things, honey. <laughs> She's so silly, I swear. I'll be right back, y'all. <laughs> What's in my coffee? Let's see, what can I remember? Um, a squeeze of monk fruit, three tablespoons of the um, hazelnut nut pod, and then three tablespoons of um, some skinny syrup. So I'm drinking that. Mm -mm -mm. That's good. It's not very light. Mm, okay, I don't even know if you guys can see it. Not light at all, actually. It's too blurry, probably blurry, but anyway, it's not light, but it's good. And then I have water, and in here I have a scoop of collagen and my electrolytes. In there, I'm trying to get more diligent on my collagen only because, because, um, your girl's getting the cellulite or has the cellulite these days, and I'm like, what happened? You go from no cellulite to cellulite all over, child. So I'm trying to be good on my on my collagen because I don't know if it can be reversed, but we're going to do our best, okay? You guys, okay, I was talking about this on Instagram. So pretty much, I've been dealing with plantar's, is it called plantar's fasciitis for the last two years. So I have this thing, I just put it in the freezer because it was thought out, that you roll your feet on, and I, I'll do that. I was really, really suffering from it when I was at work. Um, because I was walking more and I was up and up and down up and down all day But since we've been home my feet have been kind of okay But recently I've been having issues with my feet again And it was usually one foot now both feet hurt and then now I have issues with the back of um, Like my ankle and somebody was like oh that's Achilles tendon um, You need to make sure you stretch and I've been stretching my feet so I have bought some new um uh, what are these called? These are called, these are like a uh, foot compression sleep. I, I was, I, me and my friend were talking about this and we were cracking up because I was like, I refuse to be that lady wearing the uh, orthopedic shoes. I don't want to be her, but, so I'm going to wear these, but I used to be able to wear heels. And this is what I was telling Instagram. I used to be able to wear heels and not blink an eye and wear them all day. Wear my heels all day, not blink an eye. Now, girl, please. Girl, please. Heel. I can't wear them all day. Um, at all. At all. So, um, I don't know if um, the plantar fasciitis is from 
that or or the Achilles tendon situation is from that or what but I know look at these damn um socks are like they real compression all right so I'll be walking around the house with these things on I haven't showered or anything I'm about to put my nails on and then what time is it 11 I'm still it's still early in the morning so I'm gonna put my nails on Look at my feet, hold on. <laughs> this, this, this looks crazy as hell. So look at <sighs> Look at this. This is not cute. But it is what it is. So <sighs> it is what it is. So I'm gonna put my nails on. I have I put on some the other day I had a I had put gave myself a manicure, right? I'm gonna have to go get a real file because this file that it came with ain't going. What is this? I gave myself a manicure, did gel, but the gel is just not. I don't know. I don't know. It's not. It's not giving. It's, it's like coming off and it's not lasting. So I'm gonna put some press ons on, honey. I am gonna put a press on. on. I'm just prepping my nail right now with these alcohol pads. I pushed it back my cuticles. Mm. I have this dehydrator that I put on my nails before I put the glue on. I usually use this when I use my um, my gel. also have a primer. I need to find my nipper so I can clip my cuticles real quick because I feel like I didn't get it good the other day. But I'm about to do that you guys and then, oh let me show you the nails I'm gonna put on. They are by Impress. I got these from Target. Not today, but I've been had them. I got them from Target though. Impress, there we go. These are a medium set. There we go. I don't know if I'm gonna be using those though. I might have to though. I don't know about no jewels. to do my nails I'm having this prosciutto wrapped excuse me mozzarella cheese I got this from a target it is the good and gather brand so this has I scanned it and the macros came up why wouldn't it be on here so you got to research target to be finding the macros am I or maybe it's somewhere I'm not but it's on here Ugh, target you know better, girl. Okay, let's look. It's 125 calories. One net carb, nine protein, 10 fat. So I'm gonna have this while I'm drinking my coffee. Cheeks desperate for the dawn to bring back dignity. Time and time again, I relapse, but love has never left me. my brows good I did my brows good today anyway I got these pants these are my favorite favorite target pants I have a skims bodysuit on and then I have these these are Steve Madden I was gonna wear like another type of flat I have some heels that I wanted to put on like a leopard heel first things first nope my, my feet hurt they hurt and then I have that some black flats but then I don't really have any like neutral flats I, you know what I'm lying I do I do but then I have these my Steve Madden's and Brennan the style master said they go so I feel like I'm very comfy cozy I have these as well these shoes now that I'm thinking about it child this closet I, I clean it and then get right back dirty clean it get right back dirty I have these 
These are my Target shoes too. Let me see what this looks like. On these foot. Let's see. Take it off. Those shoes are comfy. Steve, man, you did it. Steve, you did it. Okay, see, but they're more comfortable than these. These are comfortable, but talking about support wise, support with these bad feet I got. I'm thinking these look more um, grown. And these look like um, I get, you know what? It don't matter. <laughs> anyway, I'm styling and profiling, so it don't matter. I walked up the place with style and grace. So it don't matter, to be totally honest. Cause I know it's gonna be a whole bunch of flip flops up in there. So I we are x naying the cookie plug because I, I'm not gonna really ruin my mood, but I'm gonna say this. If you, cause they have regular stores which just sells cookies and um, the regular cookies and the keto cookies, right? And I should have just went over there to the regular store when I was in that damn area. But I said I was going to come over here because it's on the way out. Well, this particular one is called a detox. So, not only do they sell the keto cookies, they also sell vegan, gluten-free, and they have like different other juices and stuff. The regular cookie plugs don't have that, right? I didn't care about that because I could have went to the regular cookie plug because the regular cookie plug sells keto cookies. Well, I'll come over here to the detox one because it's the way on the way to where I'm going. And she's like, I just want to let you know we don't have any of the keto cookies. I was like, what do you have? What, what, what's the point? Like, you got regular? She have a, she said I have snickerdoodle and I can cook them for you right now. But... She said, um, I can cook any of them for you right now, but it's going to take 40 minutes. I'm not waiting 40 minutes, honey. I got, I got to go. And then she was like, well, I have a snickerdoodle cookie dough. And I'm like, okay, what am I going to do with that? Cook it? I, I only need this for like right now. I don't want to give somebody cookie dough. Y'all giving cookie dough as a gift? Try to tell me something. Anyway, um, that's out, so I'm not even prepared. I didn't bring me no snacks, no nothing, because these chicks, who knows if they're going to be eating keto or not. I just won't be eating nothing. Head west on Orange Tree Lane toward California the Street, then turn left onto California Street. Okay. Turn I just, left onto California well, Street. Well, let me get on California Street. Well, damn. Um. So, I was going to bring me some snacks so I wouldn't be like not having anything to eat. But, um, I didn't. I just ran out the house and forgot to do that. So, hopefully, they have something that is keto friendly. Hence, they are on keto. You know, I can't guarantee that though guarantee that so I mean if they don't have anything that I'm able to eat um, I figure my life out I can always go and get me something don't want to buy food but listen I got goals I got things to do and people to see you know I didn't show y'all my little nails that little okay so that brand it doesn't come with glue. It only comes with those sticky things, okay? Now, the first, that first nail, I didn't put the glue on. I put the glue on this nail right here, and I was like, okay, well, I don't really need the, the glue. And so, when I was in the shower, I felt like they was all lifted. So, I had to flip them all off and put glue, file my nail again, put glue on all of them. So, hopefully, they feel sturdy now. I don't, I, I got some of the jeweled ones because, y'all, I can't see the numbers on the, on the nails. So I was just kind of like, that's why you saw me with the flashlight, <laughs> trying to look at the nail number because I can't see. I can't see. Did she tell me to make a left? You need to go. Oh, wow. Okay, y'all, let me um, drive because the people are out and they are, you know, breaking on the dime. Tap, tap, tapping. Light way up here and y'all tapping. Oh, I can't be bothered. Okay, I should.
y'all return. I mean, I gotta listen to my music. Still waiting. Did we know how to paint the nose? We're just winging it. We winging it. I can't see that picture. Well, I don't know what I'm like. Turtle on my girl. It's not a turtle neck. Not a turtle neck. Let me see. Listen. Listen. Oh, I'm so sorry. You mad at what she helped you with? Okay. Let me see. Dominic. 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 Yeah, we we got them all. R R R R P, you know, look just like a Paul Mooney. <laughs> and this one's still working on her painting. <laughs> Ten hours later. Dominique is trying to stunt now. She just now she putting too much. She putting it in like like ma'am. Mm -hmm. Really? What she had white in the day? I know I saw that, but did she? Uh, what 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 is this in her head? Reflections. Oh no, she she got she had a little streak. Okay, all right, gray hair. It's the necklace for me. I mean, mine's have a off the shoulder situation. This is how I like to wear my hair. And C's is off centered, but hey, it is what it is. And we like a good red lip around here. I'm gonna put this in my room because I'm not. A, I, I think it looks good.
crashed. As you can see, I still have my same top on from yesterday. Okay. The same top on. I just crashed now. I slept on the couch until about 5 a.m. I don't know. I had no drinks. Not one drink. I think my body is kind of catching up to, to the sleep. And I, I appreciate it. But anyway, um, I showered. What was I saying? I was going to go to the gym. But that's why I put that sunscreen and just that oil on my face. Because usually I put a whole bunch of other things on my face um, in the mornings. But I didn't want to put all my good stuff to go to the gym. So only come back and wash my face again. But I showered and I had my sports bra on. Um, but I don't know if I'm going to go to the gym anymore. I've done the five days. I feel like I want to rest, but then I'm like, I can go and do cardio, like, you know, so, right now, I'm not, I'm not thinking about going, so, right now, I'm making coffee, um, I'm gonna have this protein shake, this, um, Core Power Elite, it has 42 grams of protein in it, and I have this, while I'm, um, making that, We're gonna do some meal prep, kind of meal prepping today. Prepping for meals. Why is this not focusing on me? Please do, because I ain't got time. Um, we're gonna prep for some meals today. So I'm gonna thaw this shrimp out right now. That needs to be done for later when I need to prep it. And then I'm gonna cut this avocado because I'm going to eat it. Hopefully you can see me. <laughs> You can hear me. That's all that matters. That's all that matters, right? Anyway, uh, oh, my coffee's done. Let me get my measuring cup and a regular cup. I'm going to drink out of this one right here. This one is his daughters are like butterflies. Each one is unique, each one is special, and each one is beautiful. So, I'm gonna drink out of that. Yesterday, after I left my friend's party, so let's talk about that for a moment. Hold on, let me, I gotta get the lighting together. Hold on, maybe I'll turn it on. Um, I don't think that helped at all. I'm sorry y'all. I can't I can't control the lighting in here. This is just terrible. This is just terrible. I don't understand. And the funniest part about it is when I was when I used my um camera, I never had issues. Not my camera, my phone, I never had issues. I just was trying to get better quality, but the lighting was always right. Anyway, I need to put my glasses on because I can't really see. I think that's what's messing it up. Anyway. So, um, yesterday at my friend's party, um, they made like Mexican food and, oh, uh, there was nothing, nothing other than some carne asada and some chicken and some guacamole. Okay. So I had to do what I had to do. She had salad, but I wasn't in the mood for no salad. Some carne asada. I had some guac, but I think I probably had like two ounces of, of meat. And then a spoonful of guac. So I, technically, I really did not eat. I drank on a sparkling water. Like I said, I did not drink any alcohol. On my way home, it was so late. I did not feel like cooking. So I stopped at Five Guys. I was didn't realize I didn't take not a picture, not a video of it until it was gone. I had a bunless um, little, because a little is just one patty. I, I thought I ordered bacon on it. There was no bacon. So I was going to make bacon. Too tired to make a bacon. So I had a little cheeseburger. Um, pretty much everything except no bun. No, no mayo, no ketchup, no mustard. Because I don't like none of them. Okay. Dry burgers over here. I'm five. Anyway, let me uh, make this coffee. So... Other than that, um, like I said, I crashed on the couch. I'm going to eat this too. These are good. I need to, I need to go back to Target because I went to Target yesterday and forgot. 
I have like a small, small gap here. You probably can't even tell. I'm be stu getting stuck in there. Um. I forgot face wash. That's what I went in there for. You know, there's one more thing that I didn't get. I need to put it on my phone. Face wash and I was just looking like, dang it, I forgot to get it. Dishwash liquid. Let me put it on my list right now so when I go in there, I'll know. And then when I go back, I'm going to get me some more of these because these are bomb. I love these things. I have all the things. Okay. Um. How's you guys this weekend? You're gonna see this on Monday. How was your weekend? How did it go? How are you doing? How your mama now? Squeeze a monk fruit. We have two tablespoons of this uh, pumpkin spice skinny syrup. There's coffee grounds on my measuring spoon. Two, well, three of this. Three of these. I haven't started using the other one that I got from Sprouts, the super coffee one, or is that one called? Yeah, because I want to use this one up first. And then I'm going to put some collagen in here. I have a big collagen that I just bought, but my son bought this one. So I'm going to use this one and we can both dip into that other one. <laughs> Bubba! I'm going to put in my coffee. How I'm going to put it in your water. 42. So it's pretty much two of those? I guess. Sometimes at Costco it be like $10 off. Because it's the same price at Costco. But they, I like to get it when it be like $10, $12 off. That's a good time. Can you give me a paper towel out the uh, other room? Stop! Oh, oh yeah. yeah. Why you just can't hand it to me though? <laughs> Have, have you been in the garage lately? I'm gonna put some of this in here. That's so good. Let's see, it went from dark skin to mocha. I need to prep my vitamins today too because I'm over here just flying by the seat of my pants and that don't work for me. And that don't work for an intro. Okay. Oh, I was supposed to make this avocado. Damn it. Hold on. This is a huge avocado. My face. It's that big. I'm gonna put in this ramekin. Is that what it's called? Ramekin. Five, two. Why am I mixing the two songs? Wait, did he sample that song? Interesting. Okay. Damn. That's a lot. This half of an avocado is 130 grams. Now, let me give you like some gauge. Usually, a half of an avocado, the ones I get are like 30, 40. And a whole one is what about 70, 80, 60, 80? That half was 130. This is my regular avocados that I like to get. These are the regular ones I like to get. This is that one that I got from Sprouts. No, I got this one from Smart and Final. But they have these big ones at Sprouts for two, for four or five. So I might go back and get it, but look at that, all that avocado in there. So I'm gonna eat that. I'm just gonna put a little salt, a little lemon. I like the lemony taste in my avocado. Shake your happy taffy. Your lovey taffy. Come on, shake your happy taffy. 
need to wash it daily. I keep That's telling you. No, it's because of the put the pet time. You still have to wash it. I daily. do do it. Shut up. Dang. No, you don't. You don't know nothing. No, you don't. You haven't washed that thing for weeks get, at one point. Get, I'm get, recording. Get the avocado off the face. Well, it's still on there. It's smeared. Is it off? Yeah. Do over there. I know for sure they do over there. They're yeah. dirty. Cool. Them. They have a dirty house? They are dirty. Mm. You think dirty now? Because they be, like, you don't be seeing their trash in their front yard. They be letting their trash be going up, be flowing in the front yard. Their freaking, their trash bin is still out in the front. They got a baby in here. You need to clean up? You think the baby will want to make them clean? Did she really, did you, she recognize you? It was Oh, okay. <laughs> Hi, Brennan. How you doing? Probably, okay, they're probably talking about that. Like, they're upstairs and downstairs. They don't have, they don't have grass in backyards, right? Mm -hmm. That's what I mean. I don't know. I don't want to deal with grass or backyards. They have, like a, they have like a, um, over there by the middle school. I like it. Oh, be real focused on this because I'm I want to get out of here. They got some nice hot remember those apartments up there? Mm -hmm. that, 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 those, those are nice. I want out. I want out. I want out now. I want out. I want out now. You didn't have to that mean what that lady say, get here and get here now. <laughs> That's me. I want to get out right now. Coffee. Fresh the app, you know, see what's there. It came up again, baby. I got that order, um, and it's not even a huge order, so I'm gonna go and get this. I popped out of there, I put some clothes on, forgot my camera, that's why you know I'm blocking on my phone right now. But I'm like, this will make up for the week. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jane. About this, it's like a, the Instacart portion that they're paying is like. $20 or something, $18, something. And then the tip is $70. Now, I pray that this tip is real. Because I was telling my son, what if they meant to put seven and it said 70? <laughs> and then I get bamboos. I mean, I still got what? A $27, $30 quarter. I mean, that's okay, but I saw 80 something dollars. I said, push. I don't even care what it is, but it's not even a huge order. It's just like regular groceries. Oh. Listen, I'm going, it's right, it's a store right across the street, too. I'm heading there. You know, right on in there and do my little shopping. Get me a bell pepper in there for myself since I need. I started this a little bit after two, and it is about to be five o'clock. It's 4 59 right now. And I am on my way to deliver. Oh, so I've done two orders. Turn right onto Southeast Street. Thanks, girl. Thanks. And both of them don't look like it's a lot, but chow. I guess when people order in 50 million drinks, I used to buy bottled water. I don't do that anymore. Um, so because I use a Brita, but people who are buying things of bottled water and all kinds of just drinks, people, people. So. What is this cookie store? Is that? I bet you that's a freaking dispensary. Good cookies, cookies my ass. I want to go over to that Jeep uh, dealership right here and just look. And just look. And just look. 
just take a, take a gander. But let me um, deliver this lady's groceries real quick. She's not far from the Target. First one was at Stater Brothers, and it wasn't, he was like around the corner. This one right here was at Target, and she's not like five minutes away. So let me do this, and I will come back and talk to you guys when I am here. So far is these stuffed bell peppers. I made them like um, Philly cheese steaks, and then I made, well, I cleaned some shrimp. I'm gonna put them back in the fridge. These will be eaten within the next two days. And then I'm seasoned up some shrimp, not some shrimp, some some ribeyes, and in here is just wishire and some, um, some Kinder's seasoning so I'm gonna put both of these in the fridge like I said these will be eaten within the next two days this will be eaten within the next two three as well so I'm gonna put them back in the fridge and then I am still waiting on the uh, I have one batch of the kale chips that I made they are so good I, I put them on a paper towel before I put them in here there's still some in the oven and they are like nice and crispy so I'm doing that and then I'm gonna make a salad this is some leftover chicken that I have um, that chicken that I bought from Trader Joe's is just the leftover part of it and I'm gonna eat this with that salad and then I have a little bit of cauliflower that I had made because um, I had made chipotle bowls the other day so it's a little bit left, so I'm gonna throw that on top. Like when I say a little bit of cauliflower left, like I say a little bit, like this is it. But I will be warming this up because I, for some reason, I don't want to eat it cold. So I'm gonna nuke this real quick, nuke this, make a salad.
Um, okay, that salad. I'm not, I don't know. Like, so I gotta really be in the mood for a salad for me to wanna eat a salad. So I ate about a half, half of that salad. Cause I was gonna save this, this bell pepper for the week, but I'm gonna eat it now because mm, mm, I wasn't feeling it at all. So I'm just gonna cut it and be eating it. Um, so what did I do today? Went and did Instacart and that was pretty much it. Um, and then I went to, I went and did Instacart at two stores. They were both a mess. The one at Target was like, they were, what was I saying earlier? They weren't really, well, the one at Target was a big order. Like, the lady ordered everything under the freaking sun. And then she was messaging me saying that she wanted to add other things. Ma'am, the basket is already heavy. So, I did that one. I did one that was not a big order, but it was big because it had a lot of drinks. So, mmm. That's good. So, that's really good. It just tastes like Philly cheese steak. But, anyway, it is what time. I'm about to be 8 30. I prep my meals and meat for the week. I'm about to eat that. I need to finish up on the verses that I didn't get to read this week because I am still using this so I'm gonna finish up those verses I think I'm still I'm about to end in Genesis but I need to catch up on those verses and then um, journal in there and then I need to get my mind mentally prepared for tomorrow because it is a work a day, Monday. And yeah, I think, um, oh, and I'm just drinking some plain water, plain water, so yeah. Um, I'm gonna let you guys go because I don't have much to talk about and if I start to think about something to talk about, I will end up in a rabbit hole talking about everything else but said subject, so. I will see you guys on Wednesday with a weigh-in and a what I eat in a day. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you're new and you enjoyed this video, make sure that you do subscribe. Go ahead and like and comment below, you guys. Go ahead and tell a friend to tell a friend to tell a friend. And I will talk to you. Let's get